previously on So You're Dating a Vegan. Yeah, I'm gonna go with three as my favorite, but I think two is the Hellman's. Oh, I was wrong! Oh my gosh, that's so weird! I feel like a lot is on the line here. If I say that the non-vegan one is my favorite, yeah. we're gonna have to cancel this channel. Yeah. Here we are, with back with a bunch of mayos in front of us. Four of them vegan, one of them not vegan. What could we be doing? Last time Liz was blindfolded, this time I'm gonna be blindfolded. Ooh. Ooh. <laughs> <laughs> and a lot of these brands weren't even out yet. Mm -hmm. We didn't have Just Mayo. We didn't have the Hellman's either. And we didn't have Sir Kensington's. Yeah. I haven't had regular mayo in several years. How are you feeling going into this? Do you think you're gonna be able to tell? I'm a little nervous that I'm gonna barf. Ew. Yeah. Oh. Because I haven't tasted regular mayo in so long, I'm very curious if it'll stand out mm -hmm. and if I do like it. Yeah. Shall we get started? Yeah. Okay. Mindfold on. All right, here we go. Okay. Are you handing me a spoon? Open your mouth. <laughs> okay, there's an initial tang. Do the rest of it. I don't want to eat that much mayonnaise. <laughs> There's an initial tang to it, which is all right, but then the aftertaste is a little strange. Mm -hmm. It's waxy. Okay. I feel like I chewed on some Dracula lips. <laughs> Open. Much better flavor. Mm -hmm. More of a pickly aftertaste. Much smoother texture. Mm -hmm. Number two is definitely better than number one. You ready? Number three? Yeah. Uh, that one's um, definitely more on the tangy side. Wow, there's so many subtle gradations to uh, mayonnaise taste and texture. Yeah, sweetness, vinegariness. I would say that one's a little sweeter. Smoothness. It's lighter in texture. Mm -hmm. I I'm gonna say I, I, I liked it. It was fine. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Okay. Ready? Yeah. Oh. That one tastes the exact same as number three. Mm -hmm. Do you agree? No. A similar texture to number three. Mm -hmm. Maybe a little bit more tang. I'd just say, as smooth? I'd say just as smooth as number three. Lighter than number two. Number two felt the most buttery to uh -huh. me. <laughs> okay, open your mouth. I don't want to do this Just anymore. Open, then take the spoon for yourself. Here, uh. <laughs> That's different. That's thicker. Mm -hmm. It also has a little bit of a. What did I say about the first one? Oh, waxy? Waxy, a mm -hmm. little bit of the wax, a little bit of the wax. You want another bit? I mean, it's fine. Mm -hmm. I feel like a lot is on the line here. Did you rinse the um, the can? No, but I just took a sip, so I ate all the germs, so you're good. You just drank some rat pee. Yeah, probably. But it was in a box. You know what? It's better just to be honest, because mm -hmm. my statement at the beginning of the show was that I don't think there's any reason for non-vegan mayo to exist. Mm -hmm. Right, so if I can't tell the difference, or if I'm picking the non-vegan one as my favorite, mm -hmm. then I'm wrong. Okay, well let's start off with what is your favorite? I'm gonna say that number three is the, the regular mayo and number mm -hmm. four is my favorite. Okay. I'm taking my, I'm so nervous. I mean, if you take off your blindfold, they're all in the same order that they were <sighs> I'm before. So all right, which one did I pick as my favorite? Okay. One. Okay. Two. Three. Yeah. Four. Yeah. Five. Uh, <laughs> Kensington, you're my man. <laughs> go, 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 go. <laughs> We did it! Good job. I don't want to kiss you. Nice job. 
So why did you think three was the real mayo? It was just like... You got mayo in your mustache. I'm so excited. Nothing's gonna bring me down. <laughs> I think the texture. Mm -hmm. Yeah. It was, it was like a little runnier than the rest of them. Runnier? Yeah. Interesting. Yeah, I think you could tell with this one that it's got the grapeseed oil. I think the regular Veginase doesn't taste like that at all. Huh. Because Veginase was your favorite last time. Mm hmm Yeah. Interesting. Which one was your favorite? The Hellman's. This one to me has like a weird, weird taste to it. I don't know if it's because of the sunflower oil or the aquafaba, but... Oh, and oh got aquafaba, seaweed in it too. interesting. And kombu seaweed. Oh, maybe that's why I like it, because it's got weird stuff in it. Yeah. Simple ingredients. Yeah. No, like, pea protein or anything like that. Mm -mm. They use aquafaba as the base. Mm -hmm. Well, that's reaffirming to my own taste. Mm -hmm. And I like the buttery one, which is also reaffirming to my taste. Yeah, it makes sense. Yeah. yeah. So, there you I go. think that this experiment was a success. Has been very fruitful in testing the hypothesis that there is no reason for non vegan mayo to exist. Mm -hmm. And uh, if you have a reason, let us know in the comments. <laughs> Liz, thank you. Thank you. I'm so happy. What are we gonna do with all this mayonnaise now? <laughs> uh. <laughs> I'm not coming back with that in your mouth. Come give me a high five. No. Liz, this is a terrible idea. <laughs> <laughs>